Good afternoon and welcome to another Citroen video of my 2008 Citroen C4 Grand Picasso. In this video we're going to do a service and we've got a problem with the, the driver's seat. <laughs> So with the Citroen service, I'm, I'm going to do it off camera. I've, uh, I've done a, I've done a service before in a previous video. I can put a link to that in the description. But I thought this time, rather than going to dealer, because that's the, that's the oil I usually get, the total quartz five W thirty. I thought I'll go get it, get everything from Euro Car Parts instead, and I saved myself a fortune because uh, everything, engine oil, uh, all the fillers. We've got uh, Crossland cabin filler. Uh, air filter, oil filter, and a diesel fuel filter. So this little lot, obviously the quartz total oil is <coughs> counted, I've just happens I've got a bit left so I'll use that up first. This lot cost me about 55 quid. Zero car parts, they usually do a discount. You don't pay full price, you, you put in one of their codes and um, I got nearly 50% off so it were worth it so I'm going to do the service off camera I've documented it elsewhere on the channel you can either search for it or follow the link in the description and once we've got the service out of the way we'll get to the uh, problem I'm wanting to sort so I've got the service out of the way and the problem with the driver's seat I don't know if you can show you if I lift it up it won't move it just will not budge I've, Try some penetrating spray, and now if I could, I'd get get the seats out. I can get to the front bolts just about, I think, and get to the back ones. If you remember when I did the handbrake cable, I wanted to get this seat out, but I don't know if I can get if I can get these out. I might. I don't think they're going to come out easily. Anyway, I'll try getting these front bolts out. Um, see if we can get a bit of movement um, whatever it is might free up here. There's got to be something blocked over. I'm trying probing around with magnetic tools, see if there's a coin or old probe stuck in. I can't see anything obvious in there. So I'll see if I can get these front bolts out. Now these seat bolts are T40, I can't get in with the socket but I'm getting with this Allen. Okay, I can get these bolts out. I might stand a chance of freeing this seat off. So I can barely get in with this. It's coming out. See if I can raise the seat up. Might give me a little bit more room to play with. Which it does. So that's one out. Try getting the other one out. And move it to my so you can see.
I should be able to do it undo it the rest of the way by hand. And then just a little bit more. And that's the next second bolt out, so see if we wiggling can free it off. Got a bit of movement. Hang on, oh, I'm just free. Ah, I'm getting somewhere now. Just freed this left hand rail off. See, that's moving. You can see it moving. We know where the, where the problem is. It's this right hand rail. See, uh, so if you look there, that is freely moving along rail because with a bit of movement we've created. By, but there's no movement in this right hand rail so we found out where the problem is and uh, we just need to do we get this plastic cover off I've just pulled the rivet off at the back see so if there's any more fixings on here holding this on I'm not sure how to get this off I think I think I found out I'm just, does it lift off? Let's have a look. Yeah, I think it just prizes off. <sighs> Any other fixings holding it on? Go. Just it off. There you go, and there. That's off. That too, should be able to get this seat off, leaving the runners in place. I'll just show you because on this side we've got some nuts which you could undo. I can get to them easy with a spanner. So I might just have a go at that and see if we can get this runner off. If we can just lift it off at this side. Well, uh, get that, I'm not sure what size there, probably 12 or 13 mil. So I managed to get this out, which makes getting these nuts easier. Just two at the front, two at the back. Once I can get them and get to the rail and see why it's sticking. 
so do all that off camera you don't need to see that and i'll see you when i'm done unfortunately that was a, a big fail i've buttoned everything up uh, just sprayed loads of penetrating fluid into the rail see if it'll free off whatever stuck but if you look it's just not moving so i'll just continue living with it so a bit of a fail there but at least the service is done so that's the end of that video a bit of a fail on the seat but i know where the problem is that i can't do anything about it i've got penetrating fluid in it so it might free up over time can always uh, live it up anyway hope you enjoy this one please remember to like subscribe share comment and ring that notification bell if you want to be notified of videos as ever thanks for watching and i'll see you there.